Well, it was uh, a very dramatic this situation. We were on a beach and uh, we were about six of us and kind of formed uh, like a circle of chairs and we listened to some music and uh, next thing you know, we were chit chatting and uh, a strong lightning came through um, almost over our head, knocked me uh, to the ground. And uh, the next thing we know, I was like a flash, a big, huge flash. And the next thing we know, there, uh, one of our co colleagues sees this young man uh, fall off the chair of uh, the lifeguard. So it, it was a very, so we all grabbed our, we grabbed all of, matter of fact, our bodies and we took off because we, we did not want to stick around at the time uh, to grab any type of chairs or equipment that we had with us and so on. So it was, it was it's a sad, sad situation. Uh, uh, when we learned that the young man was hit, uh, of course, you know, we were all in, uh, in shocks and surprised uh, of the situation. And now, we just not too long ago, we learned he's, uh, you know, he's not doing very well or he passed on. And uh, that's not my heart and our heart goes to the family, you know, their loved ones. And uh, it's a, it's a most uh, tragic thing in life that you live with. And it's, uh, it's not what you promise tomorrow, but what's, you know, tomorrow nothing has been promised, but uh, today is the, is the key that you hopefully that you live a life of, of uh, you know, enjoyment. but it's very, very strange. I mean, I, all these years I've been involved in, in many situation beaches or golf courses i've never seen anything like it uh, and it came by surprise it's not something that we had a warning